Welcome back everyone, this is uh, your Vintage Beauties and we're going to continue going through uh, stuff that we started last time but before I wanted to show you this one again. So right after the show, I was looking more um, after the video show, <laughs> right after the video I was looking closely and I didn't know and then I was looking, looking and then I came across this one that we haven't seen, that we didn't notice before. And you tell me what does what guys does it say? Does it say 585 14 karat 585 W? So if this says 14 karat, that means all of these inclusions are 14 karat. Then you know, I was thinking about this cross hatching, and few of you contacted me and say, Hey, look into this cross hatching, it looks like ivory. And I, that's what I was going to say last time, like, hey, this is cross hatching, looks like ivory. But then I looked closely and I'm like, hmm, kind of too obvious, you know what I'm saying? Kind of too obvious. But now finding this 14 karat 585 stamp right here, I'm thinking maybe it is ivory. I'm going to have to take it to my jeweler because it's illegal to sell ivory. Um, so I'm ju just going to leave it until I figure out what it is. That's really cool. This one stamp really cool. All right, let's get going. What did we pull today? Couple brooches right here. That's it, no more. A ring. Okay, we have a flamingo brooch right here, no name, kind of a bronzy color in the back and enamel uh, painted in front and green rhinestones on the bottom, that's beautiful flamingo, gold tone, I don't see a stamp but it's kind of like a golf caddy. Cute. Okay. The little donkey, I think he is. Oh, it says something right there. I think he is like um, die casted and then painted, and it says. Jerry's. Oh, okay, we have Jerry's brooch. Very cute donkey. We have gold tone ring. Very lightweight gold tone. This one looks like plastic. A pair of earrings, stud earrings on the card. Croft and Barrow. Gray kind of pearls faux pearls and faceted beads all right let's see so we have gold tone chain this one's not magnetic I don't see any stamps on this flower okay Just, just uh, rhinestones, you know, um, gold tone and colorful rhinestones, <clears throat> flower pendant. Gold tone multi-stranded necklace, slightly, slightly magnetic. And we have this pendant with uh, that is silver tone with rhinestones and we have some sort of tassel things. Um, looks like cubic zirconia. It's very pretty. Let's see how it would look like. So you would wear it like this. Here we go. It's pretty cool. Gold 
single tone chain and there's some bunch of assorted charms here like a teacup and saucer with a tea kettle rose big um, ban yeah it's some kind of English thing England yeah Uh, just a gold tone chain magnetic silver tone necklace with rhinestones very sparkly and the rhinestone teardrop <coughs> rhinestone teardrop pendant as far as I can see all the rhinestones are here this one's dead that's why it kind of looks dark yeah, it seems like all of them are here. We have a box closure. It says Japan on the back. Right here, if you can see, it says Japan. Right here on the bottom. There we go. Upside down, here we go. And hair is this hair gross? Okay. Here we go. It doesn't kind of stay inside. Let's see. It should be up or down. Maybe like this. It should close with the click. Yeah, I think it's closed. Perfect. Very pretty. Oh, another silver tone or silver. Right here it seems like it says nine to five, but I'm not sure about this one. This lobster claw, and it's slightly magnetic, so I'm not sure. Maybe it's just that that portion is that is silver. This one, not sure. Still, uh, this might be silver. Yeah. Yeah, this might be silver. 925 right here. 925 on the, on this one and we have this pretty pendant but it needs to be cleaned. Pretty kind of gross kind of evil eye protection. Glass Just glass, glass rhinestones. It says 925 right here, also. Okay, so first silver item of today. A gold tone bracelet with probably glass. Yeah, glass, green, and clear rhinestones. Fold over clasp. No. No names, no stamps. Oh, this one's pretty long, gold tone chain. Not magnetic, but I think it's just might be plated, but I don't see any stamps anywhere. Uh, the condition is really good it's very clean shiny and doesn't have any scratches yeah the condition is really pretty another gold tone chain with this um, locket with a letter P on it painted oh my goodness 
Ooh, hard to open. Very clean inside, right? Very clean inside. Let's see if there are any stamps. Oh, look like it's Avon. All right, Avon gold tone chain with the gold tone locket with letter P on it. Multi-stranded necklace. have three strands right here it looks like yeah it looks like lucky brand a few strands three strands they're all like bronzy color they're all tangled oh let's see it looks like they're very layered in the sense of it's very obvious that they are layered three different strands, three different chains. We have elephant pendant right here. We have um, a lily or yeah, some kind of flower. And we have this snake right here. Three different pendants on three different chains. I like a brand. Silver tone bracelet. Magnetic, flat chain, lobster claw. We have a little gold tone butterfly on a gold tone chain. It's not magnetic. I don't see any stamps. Yeah, to me it's gold tone with a little, uh, little butterfly, gold tone butterfly. She's textured inside and shiny outside um, on the back pretty bracelet a silver tone very shiny a lobster claw closure great condition with those beads that you can probably take on and off I don't see any name there is um, a stiletto with rhinestone charm looks like all rhinestones are here there are different rhinestones on on the beads really good condition i don't see any stamps on this ring Yeah, I don't see any stamps. We have a ring here, like a band. Not magnetic, but I don't see any stamps. Seven. Silver tone. Yeah, silver tone chain with a pendant, heart, silver tone heart with faux pearl. Gold tone chain, gold tone chain, no stamps um, with this kind of pendant. And that's it, it slides. Oh, let's see, did, did it lose its... Yeah, I think so. Well, I'm not quite sure. So we have a pendant right here with a lion. 
gold tone and it says on the back it says celebrity New York okay gold tone the wrong pendant with the lion we have another locket we have gold tone chain gold tone locket kind of um, carved engraved on front and clean inside no stamps uh, it might be Avon guys yeah I think it's Avon there is a, a, a circle and a dot right here so I think it's Avon Avon another Avon locket okay this is just a chain kind of a bronzy color doesn't look to be magnetic and sometimes people say well sometimes gold like lower quality gold becomes this kind of color but I don't see any stamps I can test it later on silver tone chain roll chain with a slipper a silver tone slipper no name and it has like a green and different rhinestones brown and clear rhinestones very pretty slipper oh actually it says Puerto Rico Puerto Rico silver tone chain magnetic so it what does it say here there's some some things here oh no way it says 925 China I, I hmm the, the the chain was magnetic this this thing also I don't know I'm gonna have to retest this one I don't trust it why is it magnetic it's, it registers as like a um, cubic zirconia yeah cubic zirconia so the chain comes to a V and then it drops down to three rhinestones we'll need to test this it might be rhodium plated um, that's why it's so shiny and it will not test silver if it's rhodium plated for scratch purposes but alrighty lady so what do we have here we have a pair of earrings for pierced ears they seem to have rice pearls glass oh, this one's hard this one onyx probably this might be silver but i'm not sure very pretty earrings with rice pearls red glass and onyx beads oh oh my goodness where is your where is your might be this one okay it's no not this one it's probably this one so what do we have right here is a dolphin with like looks like an Australian opal we had like this uh, turtle last time but this one I don't see any stamps on the turtle we had 925 stamp on this one I don't see any I think I don't let's let's see it closer right there it says nine two five rise right, right in the middle nine two five okay well we will need to test him but he is very pretty oh and it seems like this chain also might have nine two five right here okay cute few bingo bracelets so what do we have gold tone bingo bracelet like 
this kind of diamond cut over here bronzy bangle bracelet with enamel right here another gold tone bangle bracelet with clear rhinestones and silver tone bangle bracelet plain let's take a look another chain with uh, Taurus This one might be silver. A tor it says Taurus. It's very. It's kind of tarnished. Needs to be cleaned. Yeah, right here we have. It says nine to five. Italy. Next one is this chain, silver tone, with a little tiny kind of a gold tone wishbone I think I think or maybe silver tone wishbone uh -huh. surprisingly chain is not magnetic a wishbone is not magnetic but again it's probably plating right here we have another silver tone muted silver tone chain with a tag let's see what it says on the taggy it says oh this one's Claire's Claire's chain with a very pretty heart CZ kind of a pendant. Oh, he's very pretty, so shiny, so sparkly. Moving on, on to the necklaces. So we have glass, green glass beads and faux pearls. Um, it has gold tone barrel clasp closure right here green glass beads and faux pearls uh, right here we have a plastic necklace spring closure brownish kind of a marbly looking plastic beads what is this so we have a bag it says Winkler, Kansas City. But I'm not sure it belongs to this. Let's see what it is. So we have a silver, oh, silver tone necklace with a, uh, kind of like an angel flowing with the blowing in the trumpet. And there is something right here. There is some kind of a signature who made it. Pewter by somebody, 87. Okay. Syro. Pewter by Syro, 87. Yeah, I'm not sure. So it's probably someone's, someone's handwork. Okay. pair of earrings, silver tone earrings in in the baggie. Oh, so pretty. Oh my goodness, look at this. So pretty. The crystals are amazing. It looks like Swarovski crystals. I don't think these are Swarovski, but the crystals are, I mean, I wish you guys could see how crisp, how sparkly it is. So we have a silver tone and we have crystals right here. A pair of dangly earrings. I don't see any stamps or signatures or anything. Okay. Let me see, we have a couple more baggies here. Right here we have um, silver tone earrings, um, kind of a very pretty hoops. They look like little tiny bamboos, I think. Not magnetic. I don't see any stamps or marks. 
very pretty bamboo like I think hoop earrings another pair of earrings bronzy color half hoops okay another pair of silver tone with cat's eye i think or tiger's eye tiger's eye very lightweight silver tone with tiger's eye cabochons this is just a chain might be silver but this is just a simple uh, chain more bracelets a couple bangle, bangle bracelets gold very gold tone and a little bit more antique gold tone bingo bracelets we have um, kind of a hidden clasp for pearls um, glass for pearls bracelet is it just scratches or something's written are just scratches okay so we have like a hidden hidden cl I, I thought I always think something's on it okay hidden clasp here we go faux pearls the glass right let me double check yeah glass pearls silver tone chain no name really good condition has some weight to it kind of a color or choker uh, chico's necklace multi-stranded um, we have kind of a quartz multi-stranded quartz blue black um, beige brown silver and different different beads and right here we have um green color faceted cabochon but it's acrylic dark green i would assume like dark 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 or blue and silver tone right here and we have chico's tag oh my goodness i thought it was a this <laughs> i thought it was a pendant it's no it's earring <laughs> i thought it was kind of weird position so we have a single earring right here and this one does not have any pendants, just like this. Now we have our color necklace, braided, multi-stranded, kind of bra braided um, silver colored seed beads or small beads. Very pretty. Lobster claw, silver tone hardware. Uh, white plastic beads little tiny beads in between no tags no nothing um, lobster claw closure uh, silver tone over the I mean yeah fold over clasp uh, let's see it says China right here chain kind of a brutalist chain uh, chain links stretchy bracelet silver tone with rhinestones that kind of AB covered colored coated AB coated stretch is good oh, what's this? this necklace Ooh very pretty um okay let's see let's see what we have here silver tone no stamps very pretty kind of a bib style necklace blue baby sky blue cabochons plastic 
another stretchy silver tone necklace with rhinestones stretch is good rhinestones are CZs right here we have CZs it has some weight to it oh it's Leah Sophia look at this right here it says Leah Sophia oh, all right Leah Sophia stretchy bracelet stretch is good um, kind of a torque necklace silver tone fold over clasp and it says oh I don't know what is this guy some kind of a a with the wings I don't know who that is here is fold over clasp let me see right here very pretty torque kind of looking necklace really tiny bracelet with natural stones glass beads very tiny all right let's see what else we have Okay, first we have three stranded freshwater pearl. They color it kind of green or a little bit um, a little bit iridescent, but they mostly green kind of color. And I think that we have silver closure. Yeah, right here it says nine to five. Interesting, really cool, really cool necklace pearls are like I said water pearls natural water pearls three strands they're not layered looks like Brighton this is silver tone bingle bracelet the kind of two-toned beads right here let's see oh yeah that's Brighton let me show you right here there we go, we have a Brighton bangle bracelet. Yeah, this one kind of Brighton. Pretty cool. More bangle bracelets, kind of a bronzy plane. Oh, what does it say here? 925, okay. Do you think it's 925? weird well, let's try again so the stretch uh, stretches scratch is kind of hard so I don't think so like the first look no guys I don't think so doesn't look to me like silver at all so liar liar fake or Rooney okay all right so we have Alex and Ani they usually uh, silver bracelets it says mom right here okay and this one's very cheap craft gold tone all right we have a purple a graduated plastic bead necklace with silver tone closure and extender the kind of maroon I think color okay what is this another necklace I think these are plastic beads yeah they're plastic beads they made to look like chips yeah, they're plastic, guys. They're not even glass. Yeah, these are plastic beads. Um, it's one stranded necklace, no no closure. 
and all the beads are plastic yeah stretchy br bracelet silver tone faux pearls um, okay so we have silver tone necklace I think it's Avon yeah, I think this one's Avon. And we have a pendant that can be a brooch. Also silver tone with some plastic cabochons. Um, this is just a silver tone chain, kind of rolled chain. What is this? Silver... T oh. I'm going to retest all of this, guys, because it's kind of suspicious to me. It's too bright. 925 on this one and nothing on this. Oh, no, this one says 9252 closure. Where's my magnet? Let's see. Huh, not magnetic, so maybe silver. And we have this very cute pendant. A glass or orange, very bright. Yeah, very bright glass pendant right here and a leaf and some stone. Very pretty. Is there anything on the on this one? No. Okay. Oh, what is this? This is pretty. Oh, this feels like glass at least. Alright, this is oh wow, this is really pretty. I don't see any okay so we have a this is definitely glass yeah this is definitely glass beads so what do we have here this is necklace with gold tone closure a lobster we have a tag let's see what taggy say Monet. Okay, we have a Monet glass bead necklace with this absolutely gorgeous pendant that is a see-through. The or kind of yellow glass see-through and on the back you have this filigree thingy. Very cute, very cute Monet necklace. And these beads are glass. Very pretty. And I think the tag was here. You can just take it off. Very cool, money. All right, more beads. A gold tone necklace with three strands with plastic beads. They look like faux tortoiseshell. Um, the gold tone kind of painted and clear, kind of tortoiseshell looking brown ones. No name, no tag. There's quite an extender, so. not graduated they seem to be all the same length okay oh very pretty silver tone on the tag it says a limited the limited these are braided um different type of chains Right here we have a black plastic, looks like vintage guys, necklace, just simple black plastic beads. What is this? Hold on. Okay. Um, pool necklace, this one's a fabric kind of strands, and we have some type of these are um, plastic or yeah I don't know here we go this is what it is chips maybe there's a reason for some reason they register like glass but they do ceramic -y kind of noise Oh, 
Oh, what is this? All right, um, muted gold tone and silver tone necklace. Oh, this one is Stella and Dot. Right here we have Stella and Dot. So we have silver, kind of very, very lightly gold tone. And then we have this pendant. Reminds me a little bit of our curry shells. One side and the other. Stella and Dot, there we go. Very cute pink bracelet. What is this? I don't know what it says. What type of tag it is. We have like a chain and robes and uh, strands and a different uh, faux, bead, uh, faux pearls and some actually glass beads. Here we go. Let me see real quickly. This closure. Okay, silver tone. What is this? This might be silver. Also, we have this and we have some kind of tag. Let's see the tag. S U C and so it's probably silver and we have this really pretty pendant with rhinestones in it with crystals in it so it's kind of like a shadow box with different crystals not magnetic very pretty this one has um, a little bit of weight to it oh so pretty all right, black and white um, looks like Monet. Let's see. Yeah, I think it's Monet. Monet necklace, plastic black and white beads, and a gold tone closure. Pretty long. Moving right along. Let me pull some other stuff from here. A lot of gold tone chains like this. Oh my gosh, there's so many. What is this? Look at this. Wow, so many chains. I, I can, yeah. All right, let's take a look at this. I think, also we have a copper necklace right here. This is um, quartz, I think. Oh, this goes straight to Jedi, it's straight to Jedi. So, so we have a quartz kind of a um, quartz tower. We have a cat's eye right here and there's some liquid right there. And I think you can open it. Oh yeah, look, you can open it. You want me to smell it and tell you what it smells like? It's a kind of a roll-on perfume. Oh, ooh, it smells like a very old cologne. All right. No name. No, no name. Okay, this is what we have here. We have stretchy bracelet with really pretty crystals. Natural. Stretch is good. Some type of quartz and jadeite. Some type of jades and quartz. Very, very pretty probably like cubic zirconia all around wow cuff bracelet silver tone and gold tone kind of a muted gold tone cuff bracelet braided I don't see any names or anything gold tone kind of a nugget looking flat chain fold over clasp bracelet I don't see any names 
Let's see. Nope, no names, no stamps. Slightly magnetic. Cool looking. My son's uh, my son's father, um, rest in peace. He, uh, his family have um, gold a gold mine in Alaska. They used to have like made themselves bracelets like that from a nugget, <laughs> but it's dried up already. Okay, silver tone. Oh, silver tone necklace. No name. Lobster claw. This very interesting um, kind of a coin looking disc discs maybe they are coins really the kind of like um religious one order i th no I, I don't know i don't think it's english Magnetic, magnetic, okay. Magnetic necklace, a silver tone. I think it says Korea over here. We have silver tone chain and silver tone puffy hearts with the big one on the bottom. It looks like um, they made it on purposely tarnished to look like silver. Oh, look at this. We have a chain, gold tone chain with a magnified glass. Let's see if oh I can I can make it work guys to, for you. I'm probably gonna keep it for now. I like them. I like oh what does it say here? Let's see what it says on the back. Avon. Alright, Avon, you made magnified glass. It's cute. I'll come keeping it. Maybe it's going to be easier for me to say, oh, guys, let's see what it says. Does this one have anything? No. Let me see. Maybe this one. Let's see how I can do that. Like, oh, let's see. Does it say 9.95? Or oh, it does right there. Don't you see it? Oh, my God. I'm so bad at it. Gosh, how can, how can I be so bad? Yeah, I need practice. All right, so magnified glass from Avon. We have a bracelet right here, a gold tone bracelet. Oh, it's not magnetic, but I don't see any signs or stamps. Maybe plated. Yep, nothing. Just a bracelet, gold tone bracelet. Very pretty. All right. We have this kind of another bracelet made of wire and some rhinestones. Very pliable. Okay. Uh, two stranded necklace, bronzy color. Tag says Z. We have two strands and this type of fringes and bunch of gold tone chains. Okay, another. This one looks to me like an anklet. It's too big to be a bracelet and too small to be a necklace. So we have kind of filigree flowers, gold tone anklet with rhinestones. Looks like CZ, yeah, glass rhinestones. Clear glass rhinestones. Gold tone chain, slightly magnetic, very pretty. Let's see if there's anything here. Nope. Nope, just gold tone. This is how it looks like. Has some weight to it though. Another gold tone chain, magnetic, kind of, kind of squarish. Okay. 
one more gold tone. Is, is she magnetic or what? Yep, yeah, slightly magnetic. No name. Very pretty though. Looks like that bracelet that we just found, right? Flat bracelet. Where, where is it? Looks like this one a little bit. Another gold tone chain. Why so many gold tone chain? Magnetic. Another one flat. If you guys want some, let me know. This one is really cool. This one's kind of hefty. Braided flat chains. This one's not magnetic. Let's see. I, but I don't see anything. Nothing here. Nothing here. Let's see on the other side. Nothing here. Nothing here. And nothing on the tongue, right? Yep. Most likely played it. It's not magnetic though, that's weird. If you want this, I can I can test it for you and let you know if it may be at least silver. But I doubt it. Alright, right here we have gold tone kind of chain, magnetic, and this kind of weird half heart. Oh, okay. This one is craft, guys. This is kind of yucky. And more chains. Another gold tone chain. The condition of these chains are really pretty. They're all very clean, but they're just gold tone. Another one, square. And what is this? Another one, gold tone chain. Too many chains. Okay, a lot of chains. Let's take a look at this and we'll be done for today. Silver tone chain, not magnetic, but I think it's silver tone with this silver tone pendant and orange and yellow enamel. Um, silver tone closure necklace with plastic beads, per pink and purple. Another necklace with plastic faceted beads and some shells. Silver lobster claw closure. Silver tone. Silver tone lobster claw closure. Oh, multi stranded. Oh, first, let's take a look at this. What is? Who is this? Slightly magnetic silver tone bracelet. Darker and lighter silver tone beads on the chain. Right here, they on the chain. Right here we have a closure, um, we have lobster claw. Right here on the tag we have this LC, List Claiborne, I would assume. Okay, bracelet. And right here we have chunky gold tone chain, lobster claw closure. On the extender we have, um, we have plunder tag. Right here it says plunder. So what do we have here? We have plastic beads and four pearls, multi-stranded. We have different color beads. Oh, wait a minute. This yellow ones, guys, they go to jade. These two yellow ones go to jade. Uh, what about this white milky ones? No, that's plastic. So these yellow beads, faceted beads, they go to jade for some reason. And this, the, the rest is plastic and faux pearls. Different color. Like pink, silver tone, kind of a brownish color, champagne color. Yeah, here we go. All right, guys, thank you so much for being with me here. Um, please subscribe if you like content like this so you will not miss um, other videos like this when I come out because um, YouTube will send you notifications. Please give me a thumbs up, share my video and comment, of course. I'm looking forward to your comments. See you later. Bye-bye.